Hey, welcome back. In this video, we are learning how to copy or duplicate an array in C++. So we have an array here with five elements of the double type, and it's initialized here already with five, all five elements. So we want to basically copy this into another array. So let's define another array. So let's say, let's just call it copy, I guess. And we'll say it has spot for five, uh, five elements there. And then what we want to do, I'm going to show you what doesn't work first and then we'll talk about what does work so you would think that you could just go something like this and say copy and you know assign values into there and it would just wonderfully transfer everything over um, but when we build and run that we're gonna get this nasty error and it's just saying something like uh, invalid array assignment so you're basically saying no you can't do that uh, so the way that we get around this is we just use a loop to copy each element one by one so all we do, go for our fancy for loop there as always, and we'll just start with int i at zero. This will match up nicely with our zero index value uh, condition. So we're gonna go i less than five because we don't want a bounds error by trying to access elements that are over and above our five elements here. And then we'll increment i plus plus. All right, so now in our statements, very simple. We'll just say, copy i is equal to, or not equal, we're, sorry, we're assigning copy i, I don't know, we're assigning values i, there we go, I can't talk right now, uh, into copy i, and then just sort of for proof, we can see out um, copy i, um, and then maybe end line, so it's kind of nice for us to look at. So what we're going to do here is for or for a zero index value, we're just going to copy this uh, this value from value into copy, and then the next one into copy, and so forth. And then we're just going to print out all of the values for copy and see if it works properly. So we'll go build, run, save, whatever you want to call it. Looks like I spelled values wrong. <laughs> all right, so we'll add in that s there. All right, now C++ is happy with me. So when we go and build and run this, there we go. Uh, so we're printing, we're seeing out the values, the individual values of copy, which is the, the array that we have actually kind of sort of copied from, uh, I should have picked another word, this gets confusing, but we, we've, we've pasted the values from values into copy. It's a whole lot of copy and paste and values, that gets confusing. Anyways, uh, when we print them out here, we're actually printing out the values from copy, uh, and you can see that they have transferred correctly, right? We get 10, 2, 6, 34, 60. And those are the values that we copied in, in order from the original array. So you can't just assign one array into another, but you can very simply with a loop assign each element in one at a time.